installation of the BE Sync app for the Lavoid 400S. After downloading the app, you sign up for a new account, as I'm doing here. You then type in a password like you normally do, and this creates an account with Lavoid. Be sure you remember to hit the checkbox to sign up and agree to terms of service. You will get a verification email sent to you. So if you go to your inbox, you find it, and then you type it in here, and boom, the app is up. Now you need to go and find a device, and it automatically found it for me. So I'm going to click on Add Device, and then it says press and hold the power button for five seconds, which I did. And if you just wait, sooner or later, it will discover it, uh, discover the device. And it found it, and now it's connecting to it. So the app for, on your phone is connecting to the device. Now you're going to assign a Wi-Fi network for the air purifier. I found one, and I went and typed in the password for the Wi-Fi network. Connect. And now it's connected, and it went through the activation process. So it's really nice that during this whole process, after downloading the app uh, and, 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 and launching it, it just runs through Wizard and everything goes. Now you can, you can assign it to a room, and I was originally, as I mentioned, put it in my master bedroom, and then you give it a name. I didn't know what to put here at this point in time, so I just put the you know, Lavoit 400S. But assume if you have more devices, you know, several air purifiers in your home, then you might want to choose specific names for it. But um, it's asking for an icon, I just kept it. And then I didn't know these air purifiers had firmware, but it does. And automatically finds it, downloads it to your air purifier for you, and gets it all updated. Very, very seamless and easy. Click the Done button once it's finished. And if you've got things like Alexa and Google Assistant, I didn't test this, but it says you can control the air purifier just by saying like, hey, Google, and stuff like that. And now it's up and running, and it's connected. And just, that's it.